Uh, we, we are back with the, uh, a topic related to uh, tips for PID controller. Tips for PID controller. So uh, we have uh, these uh, um, automatically tuned uh, PID controllers auto tune PID controller that um, that is uh, possibly cal calculated by a step 7 uh, micro bean for S7 200 CPUs and um, these values um, uh, for me based on the uh, my uh, information memory these are aggressive values and if we put them on a um, heating process we may encounter too much excessive heating and uh, it may cause to the waste of energy the gain of 6.3 and uh, integration time of um, around 400 seconds and in, in der derivative part the uh, TD of uh, 120 seconds these are these are very big values for a uh, for a temperature or a heating process so uh, let us um, just explain why these values are very aggressive uh, aggressive for heating uh, process aggressive too aggressive for heating process Uh, these are too aggressive for a uh, heating process. I I will explain you here what uh, what are the uh, mm, scenarios here for uh, the these uh, too aggressive um, case here. So we have the set value of twenty uh, during the um, during the startup. It's okay to during a startup of a machine. Mm, the machine is in cool down, ambient temperature of twenty centigrade, and uh, we want to uh, heat, mm, warm up the machine, and uh, reach to set point two of eighty. Set point two of eighty. So, in this case, um, uh, we may uh, start with zero in uh, control value, the output of valve. I just use the Siemens uh, notation here, element or CV of zero percent here. And with the too much aggressive, very aggressive settings, the um, action control valve for uh, uh, the error if the uh, set value and process value process value is uh, around the set value of 20 so uh, for um, 60 will be our uh, 60 will be our error error of 60 when we uh, apply the error to those too much aggressive uh, values on uh, too much aggressive values on um, PIND we apply the error on PID controller so we will have 100 person opening on the steam valve 100 opening 100 percent opening so from 0 to 100 then the values are aggressive so uh, the, the full open status will uh, take a bit longer so we will have a longer 100% energy consumption very long so if uh, this is the case with two aggressive very aggressive parameters so uh, the output um, I mean the process value will be somehow we have a huge overshoot of the process value and it will last for a long period of time 
and uh, because of too much energy inserted into the inserted into the uh, system and it will be very difficult to uh, to uh, reduce the temperature because we need to cut uh, the steam supply um, and the values are equal too much aggressive with the PID parameters we need to play with the PID parameters to uh, reduce the opening in the manner that it's uh, with a, uh, a minimum overshoot we touch the set value a minimum uh, undershoot and we reach we settle on the set value but with two aggressive parameters uh, it's it's a bit of uh, energy loss here too much energy will be lost here and um, we need to select the man with select the uh, PID controllers values for PID controllers manually and uh, I will explain um, the scenario here so instead of uh, selecting gain gain instead of selecting gain of uh, six I select I suggest uh, somehow I start with gain of one it depends on the process gain if you um, in some um, tuning uh, strategies the estimation will provide us some information regarding to the uh, some information from the process the, like the process gain uh, like the uh, time constant so if uh, this mm, software that are used uh, for estimation and PID tuning is not very complex so those information will not be available so I suggest you to uh, start with the uh, um, gain of 1 TI 400 second is okay you can play with that if uh, the, if this the response is too slow you can manipulate the TI and TD uh, 120 is too much I suggest to start with the 10 seconds of uh, 10 seconds of the um, in 10 seconds of the uh, derivative time so our idea ideal case will be like uh, the ideal case will be we open the valve 100% slightly during the warm up of the machine and we uh, close a bit close a bit uh, we settle we settle to a um, final final value so final opening of like 40% uh, of the opening it depends on the uh, overall performance so for process value it will be like this so we will have a um, uh, energy consumption is getting high here so we have a uh, um, energy storing in the process uh, let me just avoid making a line I want to make sure that it's a, it's a curve so here possibly we have a slight overshoot but because the energy is cut uh, we it's possible for us to um, the, the temperature will be uh, decrease a bit um, this is the overshoot here and possibly a small undershoot here and uh, uh, eventually the uh, so uh, we reach to the steady stage eventually so I don't suggest too much uh, aggressive uh, I don't suggest too much aggressive parameters for PID uh, controllers um, D is very sensitive and if you want to use D part uh, 
during a warm up it's okay but uh, during normal operation you should use it very wisely because it may um, put too much energy into the into your system uh, this is the first uh, trick regarding the uh, PID controller for uh, heating process. If uh, you you may enc encounter some cases that uh, um, temperature control may have some longer time constant, longer delay time process uh, delay, so. Uh, there are some other cases that uh, we need to um, consider them uh, during the design and implementation. So I stop the video here and uh, we will add uh, some new topics regarding to the PID tips in uh, future in this channel. Please subscribe, like and share and uh, share it to your friends. Uh, write comments uh, if you have some new ideas just share uh, we will read the comments and make new topics based on your needs thank you for watching